Hello everyone. Today we're going to see how to find multiple locations on Google Maps at the same time. To do this, we only need to have all the locations in one list. This is the first uh, way I'm going to show you how to do it. I already have all the locations here and they are separated by this comma. What we need to do is just to select them, copy, and then we just open Google Maps. and paste here and just search and Google Maps will find all the locations right here. As you might uh, see up here, you will note that some of the locations have been crossed. That means that the system could not find them. So this ones, we need to find them manually. The other way to find the locations at the same time is we go to here to Google Maps and then your places. Maps and create map. In this case, what we need to, to upload is a, an Excel file. I already have this one where, on where I already pasted all of the, of the locations on different rows. So I will just save it and upload it to Google Maps. Once I am back, I just click on import, select the file, and upload. And then I just need to select this. We need to make sure, by the way, that we always have the same row with a title. The title can be anything. On this case, I just put Sweden, but it can be like anything. So I just click on continue, click here again. And the system will automatically find all the locations that I need right here. Of course, there are some, uh, in some cases, we can find some mistakes like what we have on the left side, but uh, all those can be corrected uh, manually. So I'll just click there and on this case, what I just need to do is add a comma and force the, the location to be Sweden. So and as you will see down here, it's already located. And I'm gonna do the same with the other one. So adding comma and the word Sweden. And it's already found down here. An easy way to see which one of the pins belongs to each one of the locations is if I just close and go here to uniform style and select labels and here Sweden. And as you can see, the locations are already marked. So it's easier to, to see where it, they are located. If I need to add these locations to sub map or just check content, what I can do is just take a screenshot of this and paste it on the actual slide. See, for example, on this one, the specialist is already done, but I can just create another slide, paste the image, and try to adjust it the same way as what we have on the, on the other slide. On this case, I can just put it here, try to match it. This one seems like, okay, of course, I need to make sure that I can see all the same places. Put it on the other slide and then zoom in. And then I can flip between one slide and the other to make sure that all the places are correct. Of course, there are some places that I need to zoom in a little bit more. So in that case, what I can do is just go back to Google Maps, zoom in and make sure that the names and the places are correct. So that's it for now. Thank you very much.